Hey everybody, in today's video we're going to be looking at the Casio G-Shock Module 3495 watch and I'm going to be showing you how to adjust your daylight savings time value. This is one of the more popular topics on my channel because people have to come back twice a year to remember how to do this. You might be lucky enough to be in an area that doesn't do daylight savings time or you might be lucky enough that you are in an area that this watch will automatically adjust the daylight savings time value for you. For me, uh, neither of those is true. I have daylight savings time and the watch never adjusted automatically for me, so I'm going to show you how to do that. At a glance, you can tell whether or not you have daylight savings time turned on. You will see a DST value under this uh, top right square, and that shows you that you have it on. If you want to turn it on or off, all you're going to do is from your timekeeping mode, you're going to start by pressing and holding the top left button. That is your adjust button. After a few seconds, you should get into a screen that looks like this. You should see a blinking HT for your home time, and then you should see your current home city cycling through. This lets you know you're in the settings mode. Once we're in the settings mode, all you're going to do is press the mode button. It's the bottom left button one time. The very first time you press it, it should take you to your DST uh, indicator, and this is where you can change your daylight savings time. Mine is on. We knew that because we saw DST in our timekeeping mode. You can use the bottom right button to toggle through your choices. You can set it to auto. Again, auto works for some people. It doesn't depends on your home location. It also depends on how far you are from your time transmitter. And then again, if you press it, one of the options is off. If you've got it off and you want to put it on, you would simply go to on. Choose whatever value you want. Once you've got the value set correctly, you're simply going to press the top left button and that will save and confirm your changes and kick you back out to your timekeeping mode.